Hey guys, it is me, Happy Sorry and welcome back to Last and Earth Survival. So season 28 continues and these are the events that we have here. So we've gotten the supply event. It's still gonna last for about four days and seven hours. In my opinion, supply event is a definitely decent event. It's probably maybe top three, easily top five best events in the calendar. So today we're gonna be participating in this supply event. And uh, then we have the Stash Lock event, which is a pretty ridiculous event because here you need to spend about like 12,000 caps, maybe more, maybe less. It depends on your luck in order to complete it fully and you still need like probably like six or something thousand caps even to get like these files with rare blueprints so that's kind of hard to get but what we're going to be focusing on today is this bond crowd event because hey we can clear it fully especially we can do 25 percent more damage with ak so that's what we're probably going to do and tomorrow we're going to get this collector's event and hey later on we'll get these other ones and we got this thing but what also we'll be focusing today on is doing some more raids and speaking of raids i already have a raid prepared outside but before we hop to this raid i want to say welcome welcome to all those that have just joined the stream i'm glad to see all of you here and if you're watching this live stream after it's over then you already know what to do hop to the pin comments down below there are going to be timestamps and you can navigate to your favorite parts of the live stream a bit quicker and we are going to get ready for that first raid of the day so all i need to do is just get enough hatchets let's get enough level two hatchets let's get enough level one hatchets and let's just roll, ladies and gentlemen. And let's let's go. Sadly, I didn't clear Bunker Bravo during this thing. It's, it's just that we had other events to do when we had Bunker Bravo event. But who knows, maybe we'll clear Bunker Bravo today without even the, any of those special events. Maybe we'll just go and clear that Bunker Bravo like that. But hey, we'll see. And now let's get some simple stones. There we go. Now we're going to have 20 stones, 20 wood. So let's craft now simple five hatchets and let's leave this place. And bam, there we go. Let's get that. And hey, welcome, welcome to all those that have just joined the stream. Welcome, welcome, everybody. I'm glad to see all of you here. Very lovely to see all of you here. All right, let's pop a couple of carrots, and it looks like I haven't upgraded all the hatchets. And also, do I have any C force in any of these chests? Probably I don't, so if we'll need a C4, we'll get it from the inbox. Understandable, have a nice day. What I could get, though, is maybe another broken Glock, because we have, like, about one... We don't have two full durability Glocks, so I need two full durability Glocks. There we go, now I have them. Almost have them, whatever, let's upgrade them, and that's it. Then we can leave this place peacefully and we can do our first raid of the day. So I've already done a little bit of research because this is going to be a revenge raid. Later on, we'll do obviously more raids, not only revenge raids, but that revenge raid is probably going to have some nice loot. I've done like five second research. I've seen that the base has loot and that's all I know about it. If the base has loot, I am ready to raid it. That's it. Let's up on our chopper. Uh, let's see if the chopper's empty. Chopper's absolutely empty. So that, let's up here and let's get that. Love to the grounded video. Cool game says Unpit. Well, thanks for watching it. There will be more grounded videos. I'll try to beat that game fully. It's a definitely pretty decent game. It gets kind of grindy, kind of hard, but I like it. It's pretty fun. So guys, we're, we'll be writing this player 6968 base. Let's run all the way there. And anyway, guys, if you haven't started watching Grounded, make sure to check it out. Because I am planning to do a full series on Grounded, just as we've done full Raft series. I'm planning to do similar series on Grounded. I just finished my ATV and I realized that there isn't much to do after. Yes, after you finalize your ATV, there isn't many things you can do with that ATV. Uh, okay, we're not going to be opening that up because obviously it'll be useless. So let's go now to the inbox and we should have a C4. There we go. Let's actually get it and let's explode it. If I'm not mistaken, guys, the walls got to be exploded here unless I am mistaken. But I have placed it in the right spot. So look at this, guys. We'll have these chests to open up. Chances are I have raided this base in the past, but again... I absolutely don't recall it. Not, not even a little bit. I don't remember this base at all. All right, so let's open up now the first chest of the day. And look at this, guys. Thousand grenade launchers. Nothing. <laughs> Empty chest. No grenade launchers. No grenade launchers. It's always fun to, to say that we're going to get thousand grenade launchers, and that chest has nothing. You know, when we say thousand grenade launchers, I open it up and we get like a berry tier or something. I'm fine with it. You know, scrap metal. It's all right. But when you get an empty chest, that's kind of an insult. 
Okay, let's open up the second chest. And let's see if the second chest is any better than the first one. Well, we can get a stack of pieces of cloth so we can craft four bandages. But again, we're going to craft them outside because for those who do not know, if we craft anything inside of the base, we are making noise. And I don't want to make any noise here right now. I'll get maybe nothing. I don't need anything from this. You know what? Maybe a stack of bricks, whatever. Useless loot, but I'm just bringing this useless loot back to the base. I don't want to get back home empty-handed. When is the next Miss Survival video update? I have no idea when will they update the game, when will the developer update the game, because if I'm not mistaken, I think there's only one developer working on Miss Survival. Maybe there are more, but I'm not certain. But all I know is that I still need to craft the garage in Miss Survival, but we'll see. There will be more. To be honest, like, we are very, very at the end of the Miss Survival. We're kind of almost done, I'd say. We checked out all the bosses. We're kind of done. I just still want to do some other things, like finishing the garage. But yeah, I'm waiting probably for the new content, but we'll see. We will see. Nothing here. Currently, I'm going to focus on Grounded. Because I want to finish Grounded fully. First aid kits. Gasoline. Another iron hatch. Let's bring, that, uh, let's bring that stuff back to the base. This and probably a katana. Why not? So you know what? This chest was kind of decent-ish. I mean, stack of first aid kits is better than nothing and is that it and that is it ladies and gentlemen so let's try to leave this place and does this base get psychs approval would you give guys this base psychs approval we've got a stack of gasoline six fuel i think this base gets psychs approval it's about two out of ten i'd say when next grounded uh maybe after tomorrow depends 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 when i edit the video because i the second part of Grounded took me four hours to record, so again, I'll probably edit that down into a 30-minute video. So that'll take a while. Either tomorrow or after, after tomorrow. That's when another Grounded's gonna come out. But yeah, we'll be focusing on the Infected and Grounded, because I have some more of the Infected videos. Then what is the next Infected video? There we go, I just answered it. Yeah, the next Infected video is gonna be coming out soon, either tomorrow or after, after tomorrow. One of those two things. All right, let's drop a bunch of these hatchets. Came to that base with five iron hatchets. Came back with, what, seven, eight? Epic. Very epic. Let's drop these things here, except bandages don't even fit anymore. Well, there we go. They're going to fit that way. And let's try to pay those raiders. I'm going to try to give them those engines. Because I have a lot of them and... Uh, oh, we don't even have to pay them. That is great. That was a free raid. Ladies and gentlemen, that was a free raid. Is Act 3 out? No, Act 3 is not out yet. Act 3 isn't out. And I don't think Act 3 is going to be out anytime soon because if we're going to get an update and when we're going to get that update, I'm pretty certain it's going to be only Chapter 2 build out. Like once we get another update that furthers the storyline, it's probably going to be only this Chapter 2 build out. I don't think we're getting uh, Act 3 yet. We're, we still have to finish Act 2. So there is that. Let's drop these things. Let's drop the red tickets. And probably we have to go now to the farm location because that's what raiders want me to do. As in that farm location, we need to probably open up the blue box. And then we'll be able to do another raid. Plus, raiders want me to get three puppies. And yeah, the farm location is a quite decent place to get puppies. So that's what we'll do. Jess Aguilier. Sorry for butchering the name, but thank you, Jesse Aguilier, for the super chat. Welcome to the stream. Hello, hello. This. And let's get a few other weapons. I might bring this minigun. Why not? It's just collecting dust. We might as well just take it. Let's take those weapons. I'll probably take one or two melee weapons. And then we can roll... It's like, I have a question. Is it worth it to do Bunker Bravo because I waste more than 20 guns, but got the gas red thing? I mean, you're clear Bunker Bravo only if you want to get your ATV. If you don't want to get the ATV, then Bunker Bravo is not going to give you anything worth it. You're not going to profit off of Bunker Bravo, but you clear Bunker Bravo in order to assemble your ATV. 
So if you want to get that ATV, then yes, clear bunker, bravo. Yeah, that's enough weapons for the farm location. Let's go. Let's open our chopper. And let's battle from this place. And plus, we've gotten a junkyard event. I'm not going there. I wish this was just a simple chopper event instead of a junkyard event. Unbelievable. Um, where are we going? To the Crooked Creek Farm. Yes, that's where we were going. So let's go to that Crooked Creek Farm. Should I save my fur armor for Floor 4 Bunker Alpha or there's no place to get copper, says Neen. I mean, you can clear the fourth floor without the fur armor, so you do not need the fur armor for the fourth floor, so probably save it for the winter location if you're ever going to go there to farm copper ore. Because I haven't really seen anybody using fur armor at the fourth floor. It's not like that place has lots of freezing rooms. There's only like maybe one or two of those freezing rooms. And actually, there's, there are probably three rooms. One before the turrets, another one with meat bags, and then another one with meat bags as well. So yeah, there are three frozen rooms there, three refrigerators basically, three massive refrigerators, but you can just run past them, so you do not need that armor there. Can you show floor 5 and 6? Floor 5 and 6 does not exist. There's the trick to clear junkyard event cheaply. They can almost zero damage and junkyard says Gaga very epic. I haven't heard of that trick. But even if junkyard was free, I probably still wouldn't do it. But yeah. I did not get the spread shot! This is stupid. Whatever, I'm gonna quickly deal with these guys. Because if I don't deal with them right now, I didn't bring any spread shots, so I'll have to deal with them later. Once I open up that blue box, all of them are going to attack me at the same time. And I ain't the biggest fan of that. Totally. Alright, dealt with these guys. And at the same time, we're killing them. We're getting points towards our season pass. And points towards this supply thing. Who knows, maybe we'll get a purple crate today. And if we get a purple crate, I'm definitely opening it up. All right, there we go. There's the blue box. I'll open it up. But before we do this, let's perhaps use this minigun a bit. All right, let's go to the very top. All right, let's deal with the Savage Giant. There we go. This was kind of awesome. The minigun dealt with these guys quite easily and demanded thank you for smashing the join button thank you for being a member for three months in a row i'm dead i'm dead i'm dead okay we survived we survived we survived wait i'll continue reading that message real soon so yeah the demanded thanks for everything thanks for being here hello sec how was your day also can you organize your racks and can you level up your racks still thanks mate for the super chat my racks are organized and can i level them up we still have enough kind of space and to level them up that requires lots of grinding uh, of uh, ash and that's pretty boring nobody wants to watch me grind ash logs for hours and hours so uh, the answer is no i'm not going to be upgrading more chests unless i don't know maybe once a month we'll do like another ash log uh, ash log run or something we'll see but hopefully that answers your question All right, let's drop it here. Let's get the minigun and let's deal with these riding yokels. It's like on these groups of zombies, it's better to use a spread shot or a grenade, whatever you have. I suggest you to save those grenades on police department, though. All right, let's quickly deal with this revenger here. Oh, there we go. Now the dude's gonna spit, but I avoided that. Oh very, God. very epic. No. Oh my God. 
Let's run around in circles. Revenger time says Gaga Creamunk. Thanks, mate, for the uh, for being a member for ten months in a row. Thanks for smashing the join button. Thank you, thank you. And yes, indeed, it is Revenger time. Just 600 health left. Easy. Easy clap. And there we go. We dealt with the Revenger. Let's get those pieces of cloth. Just as always, let's craft a couple of bandages. Wait, I brought those pieces of cloth from the raid, but what I've done with them, I, I don't remember. I know that I've gotten a stack of pieces of cloth from the raid, but where I've put it and what I've done with that stuff, I absolutely don't remember. Sark Holder and people are saying Sark is 84 years old. That is absolutely right. I am 84. Call me Gramps Cyric. Let's go, let's get the first poppy. We need to find three poppies. There's no way we'll get three poppies at the farm location. I mean, sometimes it's possible to get two of them. But getting three would be a little bit of an overkill. So I'm going to deal with these guys first. Oh my goodness. There we go. Much, much better. Because as soon as I open up the blue box, all of these zombies are going to attack us. So it's better when... A small group of those zombies are gonna attack us rather than dozens of zombies uh, punching me at the same time, especially when I don't have the spread shot. So it's better to deal with smaller groups than with bigger groups. Alright, minigun is gonna break. Poppies in the inbox. Uh, the poppies in the inbox don't count. I think I've tried that before, but poppies there don't count. You need to pick them up. It's not about the... Oh, didn't mean to fight this infected bull. Whatever. But yeah, it's not about the poppies that are in your... It's not about the poppies that you unbox, but it's about the poppies that you pick up. And from the inbox, for some reason, they don't count. There's that. Even though a C4 counts from the inbox. C4 counts from the inbox. Yeah, the C4 counts from the inbox, but poppies do not count. That is weird. That is very weird. Uh, let's read this. Let's get another red ticket. And then, hey, let's uh, saw that blue box open. Bunker Charlie. There is no Bunker Charlie in the game. Sometimes you get the poppy there at the airdrop. Says Gagak, perhaps. Perhaps we'll go there. Oops. I have no idea why I went to that corner. Absolutely don't know why. Maybe the inner child is... Uh, was excited about the, those swings. I don't know. Whatever, let's get the sprinting skill. And hopefully this armor is going to be enough because it's about a break. We have like, what, 15 maybe percent durability left. So it is going to break quite soon. Hey, Sayak, uh, in the last video where you talked about the arena, if you use unmodded M16s, you might need to use more than Glocks because they miss like crazy that way. Yeah, that's why you probably shouldn't be using unmodded M16s. There, It is possible to use them. You don't have to... It's not like you'll be able to spray with those M16s anyways, but still, even if you just shoot a couple of shots, it can miss. But yeah, Glocks are better. Glocks are more common than M16s anyways. But yeah. What does C4 work, but not for the poppy? Sark, you're the last on Earth CEO. Fix that, please. Yes, I'll definitely fix that. That'll be the first thing to do. Not the not adding the ATV, but fixing the poppies from the inbox so that they would count towards the Raider's task. My 
armor is gonna break. Look at all of these schmucks. I already killed so many zombies. So yeah, sometimes you will get a harder a harder farm location. Not all the time though. But sometimes. Bunker Cyric. And that would be epic. I'd like to clear that kind of bunker. You got the purple blueprint for machete? No, not yet. Not yet, as I'm implying as if I'll ever get it. I'm out of weapons. What? I'm out of guns. Unbelievable. I have to go to the peasant ways. I have to go back to my good old peasant roots. Let's deal with the savage giant. Now let's go back to the top. Psych, you have guns in your inbox. Thank you guys, I had no idea, really. Never thought that we have them there. Thank you for the info. Is it done? I oh, know there's one more savage giant left. Can I attack him through the wall? Ooh, that works. Ogres. There we go, let's keep being a peasant for a while longer. Today I can feel it, says a pink lady. All right. Let's see if we're gonna get that purple machete blueprint. There we go, we are done with this guy. So now we've gotten the second poppy. We got two poppies and the raiders wanted me to get three, so I... Good enough. 66% done. Uh, one gasoline. And let's open up the blue box going, please, please, purple machete blueprint. Ah! Instead of the purple machete blueprint, we've got a spiked pointer. Even better. If you ask me. Way better. Spiked pointer. Here we go. Okay, let's try to leave this place and let's get back to the base. You know what? Let's bring those engines. Sometimes I don't pick them up. Sometimes I pick them up. But let's humor ourselves, you know? If one day we're gonna get the helicopter, the helicopter will require probably 10,000 of those engines. So let's start collecting them now. Let's do this. Spear mods, 10 out of 10. Yes, indeed. Every time we get the spear mods, you know that it's a 10 out of 10 uh, farm location run. I was wrong. One day you'll get it, says Pink Lady. Maybe. Maybe. Or maybe grand my grand-grandchildren will get that purple machete mod on this account. Because this account will be passed on from generation onto another generation. My kids will play there. My grandchildren will pr play there. And one day, they will get that purple machete blueprint. I'm certain of it. I only have 1,000 engine parts, so I need another 9k, says Gagak. Yes, indeed. How many engines do we have? I haven't counted them. I don't think I have 1,000 engine parts, though. There's no way I'd have that many. Well, we got this. Uh, so we got 375 engine parts here. Do I have more? That's it. We have only 375 engine parts. Not that many. Still need a lot. How many engines, guys, would you want for the helicopter? There we go. Let's start a simple uh, topic here. How many engines do you want the helicopter to need? 10? 20? 1,000? 10,000 engine parts? Hmm? All right, let's open up these doggos. Oliver. More like Jamie Oliver. No, I'm kidding. It'll be a gooper. Actually, you know what? Oliver Ramsey. It'll be Ramsey. There we go. Everybody knows that Ramsey's better than Oliver. Oliver can cook shit. I'm kidding. I like Oliver. <laughs> I think I have to say this because some people won't understand the joke. I think they're both great cooks. All right. Hey, I might not know much about cooking, but they're probably better cooks than me. That's all I can say. I got these iron wires, so I'll drop them here. 
Bam. The red tickets. And the thing is... You're a peasant, you haven't gone to Bunker Charlie? Yes, indeed. We're all peasants then. And that is fine. I can cook better instant noodles than him. Than him, I mean, we, are, we were talking about both people. About who, then Gordon or Oliver? Uh, new armor, that's what I want to get. There we go, let's get that thing. The only thing where Gordon Ramsay failed was the grilled cheese sandwich. There's a video about it, and I've never seen so many people agreeing on that. Everybody's saying, like, hey, I'm better than... Like, Gordon Ramsay's better cook than me, but... Dude, I can make a better grilled cheese sandwich. <laughs> the dude put cheese in the... You'll need to search up for that... You'll need to search that video. But the dude made a gor the grilled cheese sandwich and the cheese didn't even melt. <laughs> and people were memeing. Look at that pull when they try to separate the cheese and that there was no cheese pull or anything. I don't know. It doesn't matter. I don't even know why we started that topic. It was just fine. If you've seen that video, you know what I'm talking about. If you know, you know. The... The, the, the witch is head. All right, let's go. Let's deal with the witch real quick. Mm, let's get the spread shot. We might have not taken the spread shot at the farm location, but we can take a spread shot to the witch's place. Let's go. Grilled cheese chicken. Never heard of grilled cheese, uh, cheese chicken. What on earth is that? I mean, I know what it is. It's a grilled cheese chicken, but I've never heard of it. It's like, what are your thoughts on Halloween update? I, I don't know. We don't have a Halloween yet. There's no Halloween. We haven't gotten any Halloween updates yet. So I don't know. I don't have any thoughts on it yet. Alright, let's pop some jerky beef. And I am ready. I think I'm ready. There we go. That, that, that should be more than enough weapons, but I need to bring more than that. It's like, where's the fridge backpack? The fridge backpack is chilling right now. We've used that fridge backpack for a while. It's time to... It was time to switch to a different backpack. Check your supply cargo. There's no way we are at the extremely rare cargo there yet. We are only on the worthwhile cargo. All right. Now let's go to the infected forest. Let's deal with the witch. Now we need a grill backpack. There is a sandwich backpack. There is no grill backpack. But there is a the kind of a grilled sh sandwich backpack. So there's this. It's like, should I exchange green cards for blue cards? If you have 100 green, then yes. If you don't have 100 green, then no. That is a simple answer. Or, I mean, you can do what you want, I'm just saying. I oh, know, I didn't mean to fight her right now. Let's deal with this guy. A spread shot. Alright, let's deal with one of those schmucks. So that they stop biting me. Didn't mean to get the floater bloater. Ah, uh, that was a sick spread shot. Easy 9 out of 10 spread shot. Definitely. Easy 9 out of 10. Maybe 9.5 out of 10. But that was a good spread shot. Juicy spread shot. The only way it could have went better is if I've gotten a crit shot on that... Uh, D 
diseased wolf and that's it. Sayak the MF, always ignoring my messages, says Bebek. Well, Bebek, after I'm done with the witch, I'll check your messages. And if they're trash, I'll drop kick you. You'll be permanently banned. Oh my god, Sayak, please don't ban me! I'll see. Perma ban. Everyone gets a perma ban. I get a perma ban, you get a perma ban, and you get a perma ban. So, Bebek, just wait. Just wait, just 200 more damage and we'll see. If you have any questions, there's the frequently asked questions section in the, in the description. There we go. But I'll still check your questions, Bebek. Don't you dare to, to ask trash there and then call me out that I don't read your chat. I can't stand it. I can't stand it. Alright, let's get them. Spreadshot egg! Kinda goop. Six, seven out of ten. Bebek says, please don't ban me. Don't worry, mate. Maybe I won't ban you. It's like I beg you, don't ban me. We'll see. We'll see, we'll see. Let's go for it. Now let's open up the, the witch. We've gotten some big bones. And let's get that and let's see what Bebek said there. Because most of the time, every time somebody will ask me, that it's like you're not reading my questions, you're this and that. Most most of the time people just ask random weird stuff that makes no sense. That's it. The the dude said 10,000 and then hey Sayak use the backpack with the umbrella and Sayak's always ignoring my messages. That's it. That those were all of your comments Wow Wow Wow, just use the umbrella backpack Sayak. That's it. That's the comment and then I am the MF for not reading them Okay All right, let's get back to the base and let's get ready for another raid, ladies and gents. Let's go. Ever consider doing a Call of Duty zombie livestream every single day? I wake up in the morning and I think about COD zombie livestream. How dare you miss that, says Pink Lady. I apologize, guys, for missing that umbrella backpack comment. Definitely, how dare I... Um, let's drop this thing. Okay, it doesn't even fit here. Okay, pasa. There we go, now it fits. Let's also drop these red tickets in this bookshelf. It's like, do you like potatoes? Who doesn't like potatoes? And uh, why did I even say this? There's already at least... There'll be at least two people in the chat, right? At least two viewers watching it right now who don't like potatoes. And I get it, there are some people that don't like potatoes, but I like potatoes. Potatoes are awesome. There are many dishes that you can do with potatoes. Potatoes are the most flexible food. That's it. I said it. You can make anything you want with potatoes. Uh, let's craft five hatchets. And before somebody asks Syke why are you crafting those five hatchets, it's because raiders wanted me to craft them. So that's why I am crafting those five hatchets. Hola, sorry. Como estas is the bending. Como estas well. Como estas good. Speak fluent Japanese, ladies and gentlemen. Only here, only right now. Let's get this. Let's get the common planks. Uh, wait, and let's craft those hatches. That's what we came here for. Let's craft five of those hatchets. Three. Four and five. More grounded videos, Sayakura. No more. There will be more grounded videos. I want to finish the grounded fully. The point is there aren't many new games coming out. If maybe we had something better going on, then I'd probably have to quit grounded because the not a lot of people enjoyed it, but there aren't any new games coming out, so I will be beating grounded fully regardless. 
as it's either grounded or probably nothing, as there's nothing new coming out right now. So there's that. Also, a new game might be coming out soon. I just don't remember which one. But that's all I know. I kind of remember this. It's on my wish list, but I don't remember which one is it. Well, there's this. It's all the time when in the morning I wake up and it's like, oh, I dreamt an awesome dream, but I don't remember what it was. Same thing here. I know a new, ga new survival game is coming out quite soon. Like in the next maybe few days, months. I don't know, weeks. But I don't know when. But I don't... Oh, the winter survival, probably. That game's gonna be coming out in October, maybe 15th, 14th. I don't remember. So we will check that out. Uh, resources. Mm, let's get some wood. And some limestone. And let's craft five hatchets. And then let's go for the second raid of the day. Let's go for it. One, two, three, four, five. Forest to Forest to the AKA the Sons of the Forest. It's coming out next year. It's not coming out this year. Tharek doesn't know Spanish as the bandit. Como estas amigo? Que pasa? How is that not knowing Spanish? I'm fluent Spanish speaker. Do you have any Spanish viewers, guys? Rate my Spanish here. What would you give it? Like 10 out of 10? Como estas amigos? Que uh, pasa? Por favor, senor. How is it? I'd give it easy. 10 out of 10. Easy. Mm, where's another Glock? Somebody said 4 out of 10. What do you mean 4 out of 10? Get out of here with that rating. It's at least a 9. I'm gonna be honest with you. I'll be humble. It's at least a 9, right? Maybe it's not a... It's not 10 out of 10 Spanish, but... At least a 9. Uh, let's get this. Let's talk. I've probably already spoken to the writer, so let's hop in the chopper and let's get that all. So let's go. Today I made my first rack, says Anshud. Very nice. Congrats on your first rack. Very cool. And we have this raid named Dage Biashawa. I think I rated this base recently-ish. I'm, I'm sure I rated it. That's it. Like, I, I recognize the name. That's all I'm saying. LDOE raid Dagebyeshawa. Have I rated it? Yes. Is this base good, bad, amazing? I don't know. We're about to find it out. We're about to find that out. Well, I know how to rate it then. Let's go there. It's like, do you recommend building level 4 walls before reaching level 150, or should I ignore it for now? By the way, I'm level 97 now. I mean, it's not like you'll be probably able to build lots of level 4 walls until you reach level 150 anyway, so... You need to gather resources regardless. So... So it is what it is. To the person that keeps talking about some Ultra Vegito or whatever, I, I don't know. I don't know what it is. I know who's Vegito, right? But I don't need to know anything more than that. Thank you. Because somebody been talking about the Ultra Vegeta now since the beginning of the live stream for half an hour. <laughs> I just kept ignoring it. I thought maybe they'll stop. But hey, I don't need to know anything more about the Vegito. Thank you. Alright, let's go to the top. And let's drop and let's drop a C4 on this thing.
All right, so this raid is already nice. It probably already gets like so probably look at all those berries. Just wasted a first aid kit. But yeah, look at all of those berries. That ain't epic. I don't know what is epic. Even berry tea. The dude had 18 cups of berry tea. Crazy. Let's get this electronic circuit and we still have a few more chests to open up. I don't think there's anything else in this base. I don't think we need to use another C4. So we are probably not going to use it. But hey, there's that. Take berry tea and give it to the raiders. Roger that, sir. If I don't forget, hopefully I'm not going to forget it. I mean, there's only one more chest left, so I don't think I should forget that. But hey, let's give those berries to the raiders. There we go. Sounds like a deal. I started collecting berry tea just like just because you hate them. I think more people said that as well. But yeah. Why would you do this? Why would you do this to yourself? Just drop that berry tea. You don't need berry tea. And some probably planks. Well, don't have space. Actually, we do have space for planks. Wait, I want to get back to the chopper and let's get more loot. Even more loot. Because it's never enough loot. Uh, these things, iron, the... This, this, this. There we go. Now let's get some planks probably. Let's bring that stuff back to the base. Because we can never have too many things. There we go. Let's give those berries to raiders. Oh my goodness, I like berries! Yes. Berries for the raiders. That's what we're gonna do. I don't know if they'll be happy with that or not. We'll see. We will definitely see. Alright, so this base probably gets axe approval. Not insane base, but decent enough. Take all the guns. It had like, what, one broken Glock or something? I ain't taking that stuff. I ain't taking the those things. Berries. Underrated slash overrated. Says JH. Couldn't have said better myself. When are you going to upload more Miss Survival Series? When the new update comes out, because we've kind of done everything there besides building the garage, but there is nothing much left to do there. So once new content drops, we'll be able to check out some new things. Can I pay them with berries? Know where you stick the share and where. I'm giving them berries. They ain't happy, guys. They're not happy with my berries! Disgusting. Stack of planks. They're still not happy with it. Well, let's give them this electronic circuit. Let's share that. And let's call new raiders on the radio. And let's see if these new raiders are a bit better. If they'll be more grateful for that berry. Psych like uses berry tea. You all saw that. I mean, I just paid them with those berries. It's not using it, really. Maybe I did use it a little bit. Maybe I did use it. Twenty waves at the police department. Three guns to recycle. Another witch to deal with. So you know what it looks like. Lots of these stats are meh-ish, right? I mean, twenty waves. We can go and do twenty waves right now. Let's do it, and then let's go for the raid number three of the day. Raiders don't know the value of berry tea. They don't know the value of berry tea, indeed. They are ungrateful schmucks. I gave them like what? 40 berries, more than that. Plus, I gave them 18 cups of berry tea. And they still didn't appreciate that. Unbelievable. There's this, and let's delete perhaps one of these hatchets. There we go. Now we can store more things inside of this acid bath. And I have probably some more space for the armor, right? Because we were running out of space in the base for uh, with that, with armor. 
But now we have more space, so I can probably empty this thing. I can empty this acid bath and drop some loot in the chests. Like here. In this chest and in the other chest. Yes. Alright, let's delete this broken armor. And there we go. Now we got more space in the base. Cyric, are you being sarcasm again? Says Jujus. I don't know. Why am I sarcasm? Like, what have I done that would make me sarcasm right now? Any sneak peeks? Well, we got no new sneak peeks from the developers. So kind of no new sneak peeks. Well, they have shown some uh, scooter skins. But is that really a sneak peek? Does anybody really care about it? I don't think so. So you deleted those hatchets for no reason, basically. I mean, I deleted level one hatchet. And yes, I deleted them for no reason because now we have more space there. Yes, you're absolutely correct. Mm. Let's drop the duct tape. Guys, I was getting ready to do something. Something Raiders wanted me to do. Oh, 20 waves. 20 waves in the police uh, departamento. I will get Guno and I will go to the departamento. Mamma mia, look at all of these Glocks. This, let's get a few spread shots. I'll also get a stack of grenades. I was planning to do 99 waves today, but I don't think we're gonna do it. We might do 99 waves later-ish. How many more nades do I got? We still have a decent amount of nades. We still could do probably 99 waves today. Do we want 99 waves? I mean, I could do them. But I don't know. Um, another Glock. Enough to break that terminal. What else were you gonna do? Just doing 20 waves. I mean, we could go and do 99 waves right now-ish. And then we can go for another raid. I mean, that's pretty smart. Let's go. I mean, what else are we gonna do? I would have just done this raid and I would have done- I would have prepared probably for another raid. So it's not like I would have done anything crazy. Might as well just do 99 waves. That's it, guys. That settles it. 99 waves. Let's do this. One, two, three, four, five. There we go. We got 100 nades. Let's now bring some guns. And let's go for it. We're just gonna bring Glocks. Hell yeah! Serious or is this sarcasm talking? No, we are being serious. I mean, 99 waves, why not? I mean, what else are we gonna do today? You guys are absolutely right. What else did I plan to do? We need to clear 20 waves anyway, so I might as well just... Do 100 waves. Like, what's the difference between 20 and 99? Nothing. That's what I'm saying. Bunker Bravo. Why? So, guys, that's settled. I mean, I've already put stuff in my inventory. We're, we are doing 99 waves. That is it. 99 waves. Mm, there we go. We got the loot. Let's eat. Because you didn't do the Bunker Bravo event. I should have done the Bunker Bravo event. I wanted to do it, but there were other more interesting things to do. Than Bunker Bravo. So yeah, I'll do 20 waves regardless, so I might as well just do 99 waves. Let's get back to the base.
So yeah, later on, it'll probably bring even more weapons and more armor. What's up, funny man? Lol, just chilling <laughs> with my lady and watching your sarcastic shenanigans, open mouth smile. Maurice Cone, thanks for the super chat. Welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome. Shout out to you and shout out to your lady. Welcome, welcome. Sarcastic shenanigans. I don't think I'm that sarcastic, but thank you. <laughs> thanks for being here. Thanks for everything, Maurice. Thank you, thank you. So yeah, now we're probably going to do 99 waves because we need to do 20 waves to clear, uh, to prepare for a raid. So I might as well just do 99 waves. Why do 20 when we can do 99, right? Yes, indeed. Why do 20 when you can do 99? I'll deal with these guys. It's like I have two grenade launchers and two cavalier armors. What should I use those on? Keep them in the base. Don't show that stuff to anybody or because if raiders see that, they'll snatch it. Kevlar armor, you can use it wherever you want. Bunker, bravo. But grenade launchers, save them for the police department. Okay, let's deal with these guys. Uh, this. Again, we'll probably speed run those 99 waves. Speed run. You know how we speed run things here. Your sarcastic shenanigans has gone up a few notches since you no longer have Pizza Saturday. Pizza Saturday was awesome. But yeah, move places. And I no longer have that pizza guy that would, that, that was making awesome pizzas. He was making like pizza this big. Like literally. I, I, I don't know the, the size of that pizza. But that was literally like... Four meals in that one pizza. For like 12 or maybe 14 bucks. Like that was insane. That was like two pizzas for 12 or 14 bucks. I mean, he kept raising the price. In the beginning when they came out, like it was probably 11. Then it was 12, 13, 14. Maybe at the end it was 16. I don't know. But it was still worth it. Because they were basically buying two huge pizzas. For the price of one. And it tasted great. That's why I had Saturday. Pizza Saturday. But I no longer have it. It's called Panara or Pizza Alla Pala. How do you know how it was called? You, you don't even know how it looked like. Panara Pizza. And how does it look like? It's pizza like pizza. It wasn't Panara. But it was pizza like pizza. So guys, you know what also... You know what else that means? Uh, those 99 waves that we're gonna open up a couple of purple cards. I know, right? We've never done that before. Purple cards, here I come. Um, we need five sets of armor. Let's get it. Let's get five sets of armor. I'll also probably get the thing, the injector, whatever it's called, I don't remember. Um. Um, this... no. Where is it? There we go. Got my reanimator. Well, in Italy, at least where I am, Panara is a huge pizza. I mean, I have no idea. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know how it was called. I mean, it was like pizza like pizza, except it was square. And that's it. And it was big. That's all I know. And it tasted great as well. Okay, let's get this armor. Okay, let's bring all of that stuff there. French pizza is just cheese on baguettes as DA. Um, what? Excuse me. 
It's like, do you have a White Castle restaurant? I have no idea what that is. I've never heard of a White Castle restaurant. I, I don't have a slightest clue what is that. What if you eat pizza with pizza? That'll be pizza squared. Oh my god, Sonic, you're hilarious! Wow! I am, thank you very much. Thank you. Do you need to empty your scooter? First of all, that's not a scooter. Second of all, I will empty it, but first of all, I need to do one more travel to the base. <laughs> little pizza still costs 129 in Latvia. A little pizza? Do you mean the frozen little pizza or do they actually sell fresh pizzas there? I don't know. I've never seen 129 euros pizzas. Unless it's going to be a frozen pizza, then yes, I have seen those. But can we really call that a pizza? Probably. Probably. But still, even for the frozen pizza, 129 is pretty cheap. That is kind of crazy. White Castle had not gone international, I see, lol, says the bandit. Well, I... I don't go to restaurants anyway, so even if... Whatever that White Castle is, even if it's international, I'd never know. Psych introducing you to biker talk and some call a chopper a scooter. All right, understandable. Have a nice day. How to fix trolls in laboratory. You cannot fix the trolley down there. Impossible. Mercenary sneak peek, please. We don't have any mercenary sneak peeks. The developers haven't posted anything. Nothing new, so we ain't got no new sneak peeks. No new sneak peeks for you, no new sneak peeks for me. Alright, whatever, let's get some food. We should not starve with that stuff. Um... Um... Uh, whatever, 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 whatever. I'm thinking, thinking, thinking. The head is thinking. It might be hard to believe, I know. But the head is definitely thinking. We have a bunch of shotguns. Okay, sir. Right, a few M16s. There we go. Let's get the loot. Uh, let's upgrade all these weapons and let's skedaddle. Yo, Maurice! How is the weather there? Has it cooled down yet? BTW, my lady, says hello, open mouth smile. Hello, hello, everybody. Hello, hello. Uh, Maurice, thanks for the super chat once again. And the weather, yes, it has cooled down now. So the entire summit was 37 degrees Celsius. And right now it's 7 p.m. And it's 21 degrees Celsius outside. So Celsius to Fahrenheit. 21 Celsius is about 69.8 Fahrenheit. So yes, it has definitely cooled down. Nights are a bit colder as well than they were. And I don't even have to use the AC anymore. So yes, the weather has indeed cooled down. The winter is coming. The winter is indeed coming. Uh, there we go. We have upgraded all of the weapons. Let's get some more first aid kits. Say, so hopefully that answers the question, Maurice. Thanks for everything. Thank you, thank you. And let's say we can hop on our scooter and we can roll. We can speed run those 99 waves. I need to get the reverse timer. Not the timer that counts from zero. The stupid chopper. 
Well, let's quickly fill it up with things and then I'll sort it out. But yeah, I want to get the reverse timer. The, let's say we'll start counting down from, let's say, 45 minutes. I think it'll be more fun than the timer that counts from zero. I don't know, though. There we go. This loot here. This there. And we need to drop some iron and gasolinium. All right, let's drop it here. And then we can get the first, the M16s and we can roll your call button. Sponsoring 98 waves. Call button. Thanks for the super chat. Welcome to the stream. Hello, hello. 98 waves, you say. We can definitely do it. There we go, ladies and gentlemen. 98 waves it is. Thanks, Colbun. Thank you, thank you. And I'm not kidding, guys. We are dying on the wave 98. Oh my god, Tank, don't do it! Well, internet is gonna lag on the wave 98. And there's nothing I can do about it. It's not gonna be my fault. Put the timer on 30 minutes, Cyric. I, I don't know how to get that timer so that it would start counting down. Like, I don't know which button to click. And it's not like I'm advanced enough, right? I wouldn't say that I'm not tech savvy, but dude, you know what? That timer is like from 1990s and maybe there is a button to to add it. It's just that I don't have the time right now to go and... Not like I don't have the time right now. I don't want you guys to wait for me while I'm searching on how to get that reverse timer. <laughs> Somebody says, for no reason, just do a flip. <laughs> like what does it have to do with anything? Just do a flip, Cyric. I've done 298 waves back to back. Got lots of cards to scroll, but very nice. Very, very, very epic. Very cool. 98 ways twice. Imagine we're gonna do a 24 hour live stream, and all I'll do is just clear police department for 24 hours. I'll keep just doing 98 waves, like non-stop, back to back. Hmm. Do you think that'll be cool? Yes, I didn't get the doggo. That's fine. Doesn't matter. Um, there is no countdown setting in the live split that I see here. There are personal bests, other stuff, but I don't see the countdown. And you know what? It is absolutely fine. Let's add this thing. There we go. We can roll with it. We'll just have a timer. Okay, it's like, what do you think about cheaters? Says it's your run master. Thanks, mate, for the super chat. And uh, they're not cool. Don't cheat. That's all I have to say. Uh, all right, I think I'm ready. That's it. Do you see this thing? Yes, you see. This is how we open it up. Yes, that's it. There we go. Everything works. And let's start it, ladies and gents. We are ready. There we go. The timer is rolling. So for those who didn't know, I had to clear here 20 waves in order to prepare for another raid because raiders wanted me to clear 20 waves, but... I was like, why not just go and do whole 99 waves? Except we're going to be doing 98 waves because internet is going to lag on the wave 98, 98 and I'll die. It's not my fault. I can just feel it. Let's get another weapon, and I think after this wave, I'll start using grenades. I mean, I brought them. I might as well just use them, right? I got them, and I will use them. Launcher. I did not get launchers. I did bring grenades, though. I did bring nades instead of the launchers. Let's go wave number seven. How's your last blueprint? I still don't have it. But hey, we're doing 99 waves, so who knows? Maybe, no, oops. We're doing 99 waves, so who knows? Maybe I'll get that 
last purple blueprint today. Again, I don't even know if it's possible to get melee blueprints in the police department. I mean, it is possible, but I'm not certain if you can get that particular one. The machete blade blueprint. Kind of wasted that grenade. Which is disappointing, to say the least. Alright, let's pick up the loot, because for those who didn't know, there's only a limited amount of dead bodies that can be on the map. And once you reach that limit, bodies will start despawning. I hope they bring back the prison raid, says Fountain. Uh, I guess so. I did like the prison season. Would be cool if it appeared once again as a, some sort of an event in the calendar. I, I would, I would like that. I would definitely like that. I expect Psych to die at wave 50, but I mean we have the reanimator. It's impossible for us to die. Grounded stream, please. There will be grounded videos, not the live stream. Perhaps maybe later someday. Perhaps. All right, let's stay on it. Let's wait. There we go. That was nice ish. Another weapon broke. Is it possible to get the nail gun without giving real money for VAP, says Mustafa? No. Not that I'm aware of. It's impossible. Before you could get it once you start a new account, but that's no longer possible. So yeah, you cannot get the nail gun, aka the brutalizer. There we go. And we're already almost done with 20 waves. And then five times that, and we'll be done. The stupid riot zombie, a single riot zombie, and he picked up that shield twice. Unbelievable, disgusting. Very disgusting. All right, let's deal with these guys. Once again, still threw that grenade a bit too far. Very sad. The nail gun was so good for free to play players. It was really good, guys. You are definitely right. The nail gun was great for the beginners there. Once you start the game, they let you the taste of that nail gun. You could do a couple of waves in the police department with that nail gun. It was definitely nice. But hey, there we moved it. Alright, let's go for wave 15. There we go. That was a nice grenade throw. Which is easier, grenades, launcher, or mines, says the bandit. Well, mines are probably the easiest. But grenade launchers or mines, I think they're both the same. So yeah, I think they're both the same. Again, gun is almost broken, so I might as well just delete it myself. And then it's suffering. Let's throw the nade. Alright, so far perfect grenade throws. So far I'm not messing things up. Oh wow, there we go, just damaged myself with that grenade. It's like if you watch a video twice on YouTube, does it count to viewers? I'm not a YouTube guru. I have no idea how it counts it. I think it depends on how much time you watch it, how soon you've watched it. I, I don't know. I don't even know if anybody knows that. From what I know, if you get a view, right, the view will probably count immediately. But after a while, they recount your views, which one are real and which ones aren't. And uh, I don't know how it will work. If you watch one second of one video, 
It won't count. And if you watch that one second of one video like three times, it's not gonna count as three views. That's all I know. Because that's not how it works. But how it works, I have no idea. Oops. Uh, there we go. We are done with 20 waves. So we could go back to the base. And get ready for the raid number three. But why do that when we can just continue further and do 99 waves? Hmm? Are you doing 99 waves right now? Yes. Yes, as I said, for the past like 10 minutes that I've been talking about, we are going to do 99 waves. Had to do 20, but we're going to do 99. 99. Wave 23. Sometimes the grenade just works perfectly. But sometimes I still make a mistake. Alright, let's go wave 25. Let's step on the nade. Let's wait a second. And there we go, like this time. I've gotten some damage into the animator! No! Well, I'll have to use another one then. Let's use the another reanimator. Leg shot. Guys, why would I use a leg shot here? It just uses more durability of the gun and it's kind of pointless in the police department. Alright, let's quickly go here. A consumables and we should get another reanimator. We have them, I might as well just use them. Say, so for those who don't know, we're doing 98 waves, excuse me, not 99. What happened to the free-to-play account? It became non-free-to-play and there was nothing else to do anymore. I mean, there isn't much left to do on our main account. Like, what am I going to do on the free-to-play account there? Like, there's nothing to do there. Besides Bunker Alpha. Oh my goodness. Oh lord. Throw the nade. Stay on top of it. Did it work? Oh my goodness, the stupid brawler. Look at these heads rolling, very beautiful. It's uh, Siran Master. Thanks for the super chat. I can do 100 waves for your epic community. That's what we are doing. Thanks, Siran Master, for the super chat. Welcome to the stream. And you're absolutely correct. You guys are awesome. Definitely epic. Whoops. I've damaged myself. What is the next Conan Exiles episode? Uh, I think there will be more Conan Exiles. I just don't know when and the. When, yeah. Wait, my head was spinning. My head is spinning, actually. I breathed in too much air at once. <laughs> That's what happens when people ask me about Conan Exiles. Well, there will be more Conan Exiles, right? Probably at least one more episode. But I don't know when. Uh, what? How many waves do you have to do before they start disappearing? The tokens? I don't know how many waves. Maybe there are 20 dead bodies, maybe 30. I have no idea, never counted. Just pick them up every wave and that's it, to be sure. Can't go wrong with that. Let's go wave 30. What's the best way to get a grenade launcher? Says... Uh... Safaria. I have no idea. There aren't many waves, that's what I mean. I have no idea what's the best way to get it, but I know a way to get it. Is from... The floppy crates. I don't think there's another way to get those grenade launchers. Like, sometimes you can get it from the season pass and that's it. Most of the time it's gonna be a paid reward anyways. So, there's that. You just start playing Ark Fjodor's and there's a new map that just got released. Wait, there's a new map in Ark Survival that got released again. I mean, they released Fjodor like a month ago. Or maybe like two months ago. The Fjodor is still new. It's still new. 
Have they really released a new map in Ark? I really don't want to restart it. I'm not restarting it. I haven't played in Fyodor, so I'll play in Fyodor. I don't care about the new map. It's too late. We'll play in Fyodor now. Gambling at the gas station gives you grenade launchers, says right, Rishi. Yes, that too. Uh, can do that as well. Alright, there's the right zombie. Use the reanimators wisely, yes. That's why I suggest you guys to use them only while doing 99 waves or clearing Bunker Bravo. Because you're putting a lot of resources on the line while clearing Bunker Bravo, so you might as well just use your reanimators there. You spread shit after the grenade, says Joshi. We've done that in the past, it just... It is doable. It's just I won't be able to use it as often as I want to use it as there's the recharge timer, right? So I'll have to keep switching those weapons. Otherwise, I'll have to shoot with that grenade launcher, those basic zombies when it's recharging. Does it make sense? Look at this. I'm just going to show you what I'm talking about real quick. There we go. Let's say we're going to do wave 30, 38 now. I'll throw it. I'll stay here. And I do a spread shot. We can quickly deal with the zombie. And look at this. I'm going to do wave 40. I'm gonna throw this. And I don't have a spread shot here. That is the reason why I don't use it. Alright, let's pick up these cars before they despawn. It's just a bit inconvenient when we are trying to do 99 waves a bit faster. Get the cards or they'll disappear. Yes, indeed, I started picking them up. And we already have five blue, which I guess is decent on wave 40. Not the best, but that's something. Thank you for your education. I don't think it's... I don't think it's actually education. I mean... You can just always take your time. But yeah, I'm just trying to kind of do it a bit faster, so... So there's that. Uh, let's get this. And uh, let's get the, the, the whatever the thing is called. Grenades. Let's go wave 40. Oops, the nade just exploded in my face. It would be awesome if we could start another wave before this riot shielded zombie dies. Now look at this, look at this! What's going on? Why did you pick it up? Why do you have to be so annoying? Hmm? Is this a pesky little bugger? Or whatever they say there, I don't know. I love how the people in the comment section are asking you questions like you're Google. I am Google. Welcome, guys. Welcome. Let's go wave 43 and I don't have the nades! Throw it. I'll wait for it and it's gonna pop. And it didn't pop properly. <sighs> oh my goodness, almost exploded there myself. That would have been very sad.
Let's go wave 45. We're almost halfway there. Almost. Sixteen minutes so far. Yes, I need almost seventeen. Go and drop the shield though. Got it. Let's go wave forty seven. Can throw the grenade. We can stand on it. And boom. Perfect grenade throw. Perfect. Can't get better than that. Wave forty eight. So I think after a few more waves, I'll start picking up the things. Okay. Let's go. After maybe this wave, I'll pick up the cards. Let's go wave 49. I hate riot zombies. Yes, indeed, riot zombies are very annoying. Threw the grenade a bit too early. But uh, what can I say? Do it be like that. There we go. I've picked up everything. I have no idea how many cards we have now. How many of those blue cards? I'll check that later. Let's go another wave. And apparently I'm holding the shotgun or whatever, so let's use the shotty for now until it breaks. I bought a few shotguns, so I might as well just use it. The shotgun's really nice against riot zombies, though. Really good. Okay. Pretty decent. We have lots of shotguns at the base. I might as well just use them. Even though, again, shotguns are best and most efficiently used with a spread shot, but I might as well use them here. Why not? Maybe. We'll see. But still kind of sad to waste 80 damage on a 40 health zombie. But it's very fast. Okay, we still have only five blue. I was expecting perhaps more. When is your next episode of Grounded, says Jacob? Very soon. Either tomorrow or after tomorrow. So there are tier lists of zombies that are annoying. Tier lists of zombies that are annoying. Um, Alright. To put all of those zombies in S++++ tier. All of them are annoying. There we go. Problem solved. Uh, let's get another armor. Wait, do I need... I don't need to get another armor. Wait, let's use this one for now. Because soon I will run out of all the armors. And that ain't cool. I mean, Spreadshot is definitely cool when it works. But like here, for example, the dude has 40 health. And I have to waste that spread sh the shotgun on them. Do you do playthrough on your other characters? Uh, playthrough on my other characters? What? Let's go wave 57. And maybe now the armor is gonna break, but it hopefully doesn't. Well wasted the spread shot. When is the next Tom and Jerry live? What? <laughs> what are you talking about? Another blue. Alright, so at least we've gotten the sixth blue. That's something. That is something. Ten more cards to go. So yeah, for those who don't know, whatever amount of blue we get, uh, I'll exchange them for... Purple. That's the goal. Open up purple, maybe. 
Or maybe I'll open up only one purple and the, the rest will be blue. I, I don't know. We'll see. It's been a long time since we've opened up blue cards. But where's the fun in blue cards, huh? Purple cards, that's where the... That's what's fun. Let's go 59. This armor is, is not going to hold any longer. It's holding by thin, thin thread. But I'm still using it. Third, can you hold one more wave? For, nah, it's gonna break now. There's no way it could hold one more wave. You know what can hold one more wave? This armor. Look at it. Look at this beauty. It can still hold a few waves. Alright, both of these guys had their shields up. Delete the armor, now it's goop. I'm not deleting it, we're just switching it because deleting takes time. So why would I delete it? I'm just gonna leave it in this locker and that's it. It will recycle itself here. What am I doing? Why did I get that stuff? I don't know, let's go wave 30, 60. Let's go wave 60, that's what we are doing. Oh wow, look at these schmucks, three of them. If we had a grenade launcher, we could just do one shot on all of those three riot zombies. Would have been very, very lovely. If you have four more zombies, use the spread shot. No, the spread shot is definitely worth it once we have like even like three zombies, like whatever. Probably not even then worth it, but still at least something. I'm just saying that using the spread shot, using a simple shotgun shot on zombies that have only 40 health, Kind of wasting the shotgun. You know what I mean? But still, it is what it is. It's not like we're trying to be super efficient here. We got only one shotgun here left, and that's it. I thought we I brought more shotties. But apparently I did not. Probably this armor is gonna break. Didn't want to stay there too long close to that grenade to find out if the armor is going to break or not. So I ran. And so did that bloater. And it wasn't damaged by that grenade, sadly. Let's get it. Anyways, do you play in the crater? No, I haven't played in the crater for a while. And there's nothing much to do in the crater. That's why I don't really play in the crater. Hopefully that answers your question. But perhaps one day we'll go back to the crater. If you could ever believe that, everybody starts laughing. <laughs> we'll definitely go to the crater, guys. Definitely. Oh my goodness, that's it. The armor is going to be gone there. Wasted. And the armor gone. Disgusting! Disgusting. Well, at least we had this good old block. Probably gonna get a purple AK. I mean, we don't need a purple AK. We need a purple machete mod. Uh, let's get another armor. And that's wave 64 and the timer's at 25. Okay. Oops, 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 there are these guys. Let's get the M16, let's use it, why not? Wave 66. Oh my goodness! Wasted it again, I'm sick and tired of it. Sick and tired of these slow brawlers. And the stupid ride zombies. Alright, this gun is about to break, so let's delete that and wave 67. 
What's even more annoying is that we kill these zombies all around this place, so... I can't even gather them in one spot. I need to run around the map now to gather all the loot. To gather their cards. Let's go wave 68. Oh my goodness, again, three riot zombies. Is level 209 max level of the game? Yes, it's the max level of your character. You can't go higher than that. It's like I'm at level 144. Do you have any suggestions to leveling up faster? Says Tad. And yes, at the, at the base you get the healer. And sometimes that healer gives you healer buff. So get that healer's buff. It gives you plus 100% to experience and clear bunker alpha. It's one of the fastest ways to level up. Well, I'll pick up all the loot again. It's been a while since we've picked it up. Let's get it. Perhaps more blue cards. There we go. Just spoke of blue cards. Just spoken of them. I've not gotten a seventh blue. Wave 71. Alright, this gun is gonna break. Oh, let's get another Glock. Save those survivor books. Once you get a stack, use healer and then use the books as the bandit. Yes, also you can get the buff from the... The healer's buff also applies towards those books. The valuable survivor diaries especially. So yeah, by clearing the farm location, you can get, let's say, a stack of those valuable survivor diaries. And then you can get the healer's buff and read those books. And you should get, like, more experience. So there's this. Wave 73. Oops, stayed definitely a bit too long. Psych would write a book and call the steps to success in last on earth and it just says bunker alpha in it. Yes, like 300 page book and in every page is just bunker alpha, bunker alpha, bunker alpha. Maybe that's what it is. Maybe that's what the book would say. Imagine writing a book about last day on earth. That would be actually crazy. Who would read that book? I don't see a single last on earth player opening that book and reading it. I'd be like, hmm, that's a nice nugget. That's a nice tip and trick. No one's ever going to say that. I would, says Rudo. I would more people are saying that they would. Guys, stop it. You would really read a book about Last Day on Earth. Guys, you don't even know how to read. What are you talking about? Oh my god, Sake, you got me! No, but I'm just saying, who would read a book? Like, all jokes aside, guys. Stop, stop being guys' sarcasm. Right? You guys are so sarcasm. Like, are you real or are you sarcasm? We would. Like, guys, you would read a book definitely for the memes. Again, it depends. Like, what, what, what? 
Depends how thick is the book. Alright. How thick is the book? Like, if it's five pages with pictures, like, yeah. But it's... It's not really a book book, but let's say it's like a normal thick book. And basically my entire free-to-play is just... My entire free-to-play Let's Play is just put into words. It starts like Last on Earth Survival is a mobile survival game. You can grind loot. To get loot, you can go in the forest and chop down trees there. The best way to chop down trees is with level 1 axe. To craft a level 1 axe, you need to find 3 stones and 3 pine woods. To get those stones and pine woods, you need to go to a green zone. In that zone, run around and search for stones. If you see a zombie, sneak attack that zombie. To sneak, you can find that bottom button in the down right corner. And it's like, who would read a book like this, huh? It's like, I would read that book! Then I'll write it just for you. I'll be selling that book for $9.99. Heck, I'll even voice over it. That'll be... If I'm gonna voice over a book... And I put it up on... Audibles.com... Wouldn't that be the same thing as a Let's Play? Hmm? You should buy it, it looks like it'd sell a lot of copies. Again, people saying that they would read it doesn't mean that they would buy it. And even if I write a free book, no one's gonna read it. Because we know it. Again guys, it's not like I'm sitting here and thinking on how to write a book about Last Day on Earth. I'm not a writer, ladies and gentlemen. I have nobody. But we're just talking about hypotheticals here. New York Times bestseller. Last on Earth Survival. Except we would need to come up with a nice name for that book. When the last day becomes forever. Something like that. You need to kind of. I don't know what's going on. Why the game is kind of shining like this? Here it's like this. Here it's like this. Here it's like this. Here it's like this. What is going on? I have no idea. Smash like, smash subscribe. Let's go wave 81. Dude, that's it. We're almost done with this police department. Totally did not expect that it will be done so quickly. Honestly, I thought it's gonna... I thought it would take us more time. I will give my life for a Last on Earth book. You could make Kefir level profit on that book and make every chapter $9.99, says DA. Yes, indeed. You buy the book and it would still be like selling the book, like the... the hard book. Not just... book on Kindle, but just like a normal book. A physical copy. And you buy that physical copy, and pages are there, but the text is just blurred. Not a full version. That'd be such a waste. It's like, you printed the book, you wasted the paper. But those pages are just blurred. You need to buy the full book, another chapter. I would buy a book about Bunker Bravo. This teaches everything you need to know, tips and tactics. When you buy that book, what would you expect? That, you, that you'll be able to clear Bunker Bravo with a spear? It's not gonna happen. You need to have a bunch of guns. And once you have guns, there are no tips and tricks involved. Like in Bunker Bravo, there, there are no... There aren't a lot of tips and tricks. You just assemble the terminals. You assemble the... The turret terminal. The vent clearance terminal. And there's one more. Vent clearance and whatever else. I don't remember. Uh, the patrol cancel terminal. You get those. And that's it. 
And then you just blast your guns and keep your fingers crossed that you don't make a mistake. But now once you have those reanimators, it's even easier. You can even make a mistake and you're still gonna be fine. No, you buy each chapter and then assemble it yourself. Yes. You buy the book and it's random. It's like, it's gotta be a loot box. I'm gonna, guys, combine books with loot boxes. You buy the book. Let's say the book will have 10 chapters, but you don't know which chapter you're gonna get. Let's say you bought a book and you got chapter 3. You bought another book and you still got a chapter 3. So 10 bucks for two number 3 chapters. Does that make any sense? And you'll need to keep buying until you assemble the entire book. Dude, I am a genius. Holy moly, what am I doing here when I could be selling books? Alright, let's go wave 86. Actually, still 85. They've done how the waves work before. As soon as you start the wave, the number would change, no? Now the number changes once you kill the, the last zombie here. Look at this, guys. Look at it. It's wave 85. Was it? Has it always been like this? No, it hasn't. Look at this. I'll kill it. Wave 86. It switched. It wasn't always like that. I don't think so. The armor is gonna pop. There we go. Armor pop. I'll get a new armor. A monthly subscription book. Mm. Let's now pick all of this stuff up. So guys, that's it. As soon as I'm done with this live stream, I'll start writing a Last on Earth survival book. Ten chapters. Each chapter, $9.99. Or a combo. You can buy the entire book, all ten chapters, for, for a small price of... Uh, I don't even know. Ninety-seven, ninety-nine. Let's say a promotion, an insane promo. <laughs> a limited time book that if you don't finish it in ten minutes, it charges you ten dollars. Yes, that sounds like a nice book. Eighty-four, ninety-nine. I mean, that's a sick promo. I'm not going to be selling the book for that kind of promotion. I'll be broke, ladies and gentlemen. One dollar promotion. Take it or leave it. And even then, to get that one dollar promo, you need to insert some sort of a coupon code. And it's the coupon code is changing every 30 seconds. The book should have 209 pages, says Adrian. Yes, indeed. Just as 209 levels in Last on Earth. Epic. Very epic. The book written by Happy Cyric. And there will be me. I know that, guys, there is the timer. And there will be me standing with the book in my hand. And looking at the camera with my... Uh, fixing my glasses like this. That'll be the cover of the book. That's it. I had to do it. We will do it, ladies and gentlemen. I'm writing a book. That's it. I'm writing a book. Actually, it's, speaking of books, it's been a while since I read books. It's been a long time. But I'm planning to read again. As soon as my French gets a bit better, I'll start reading in French. That's my goal, at least. Let's get that. And we got 10 more waves, or maybe even 8. As I said, we're probably gonna die on wave 98 for the memes. Because why not? Gamers don't read books, says uh, Bonsoir. Um, facts. Gamers don't know how to read.
All right, let's go way of 92. Bonjour, Sayak. I don't know anything else in France. Says Infinity. Very nice. Bonjour, everybody. Bonjour. Wouldn't it be better to read French books now to get smarter? Uh, I tried reading a book recently. It's still a bit too hard. Like, every sentence, basically, I need to look up a word. It's still... cancerous to read that way. Zombie. Finally. But hey guys, I'm just joking about books. Nobody's writing a Last on Earth book. But! Speaking of Last on Earth books, I remember a few years ago. I, I don't remember everything, so take everything with a grain of salt. It's been a really long time ago. Either someone... I think there were two people. Somebody was saying that hey, I'll write a Last on Earth book, but you have to promote it. But that was a really long time ago. And then I remember some dude DM'd me saying that hey, I've written a Last on Earth book, promote it. That's what they were saying. That's it. That's all I know about it. So you know what? Somebody has already beaten me to it. Somebody's already uh, written Last on Earth book, probably. If Last on Earth had a book, 84% would be blank pages because uh, of the little amount of permanent content, says Kiro. That is very smart. Very deep. Right, let's deal with these guys. Oops, my gun almost broke. Actually, I almost stepped into that explosion. Almost exploded in that explosion. Kefir is writing a book now before you end 99, 99 waves. Probably. They've seen the demand for the for the book. You can improve by practicing your French with us, even though some of us would not understand. Now, I think there is place and time for everything. I don't think I need to practice French here in front of you guys. That'd be awkward, I guess. All right, let's pop the riot zombie. So how many ways we've killed? 98, wait, is that it? Do we die? Actually, I was supposed to die here. Maybe we die on this wave. I don't remember. I have no idea what's going on. Wait, guys, I have to come back. Damn it, I'll be back soon. Let's say, guys, I die. This is so sad. Damn it! Totally wasn't planned. Can't believe it. Oh no, the lag. Yes, indeed, it lagged. Uh... 
Yes. It lagged. Can't believe we died. I can't believe that, sir. I just wanted to refill my bowl of water. And it died. And then I turned into a pickle. Hopefully I don't die with this stuff. Wait, let's get some bandages. I don't trust whatever is in that police department now. I hate last on earth because of this. Exactly, like sometimes you just lag. And then you just turn into a pickle and boom. You die. Oh shit, you died. That was unexpected, yes indeed. I agree, that was unexpected. Totally unexpected, guys. Is there a point in being in a clan? Absolutely zero point. I mean, unless you're playing in the crater, then yes. Other than that, there isn't a lot of point. Maybe I can even pick up the loot and everything. There we go, there's my body. There's my body. One button and we did it and we have 14 blue cards, which is definitely reasonable. Okay, so let's exchange them for... And my armor broke. Okay. I mean, obviously there were lots of zombies, so yeah, they just shredded that armor probably. should play Saints and Sinners. I think I've made an episode on it. I think I've made one episode on Saints and Sinners. There we go. Let's get this. Let's now bring more loot. Sag the timer. Oh, the timer's still going. Yikes. <laughs> well, the timer failed. There we go. Let's hide the timer then. If you read this, I'll trash my grenade launcher, says Hamburger. Go on, trash it right now. Delete your grenade launcher. Delete it right now. I'm kidding, no need to delete that grenade launcher. Don't do it. Don't delete that grenade launcher. Think of all the fun things you can do with it. He won't. Of course he won't because he doesn't even have it. Smash like, smash subscribe. If you'd like to hear more epic jokes like this. Are you cry? Says F. Lalhamhadai. Sorry if that I butchered the name. No, I don't. No, I am not cry. Are you cry? I'm not cry. What is the highest level you can reach? Level 209. He does... He isn't cry. He's sarcasm. This is infinity. Yes. I am sarcasm, ladies and gentlemen. I am not cry. So yeah, guys. We've just cleared those 99 waves. And what are we going to do now is open up a few purple cards. That's what's up. Purple cards. That's what we've all gathered here. For the purple cards. Should I be exchanging them for the purple cards? Probably not. I mean, we can get a lot of guns from these blue cards. But am I still gonna exchange them for the purple cards? I guess. I don't know. <laughs> yes, we will. Yes, absolutely we will. Let's get it. Just two purple and that's it. Perhaps maybe one blue as well. There we go. Two purple and one blue. That's what I'll do. Let's get rid of this armor just so that I have more space to bring the loot. Uh... 
this, 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 and this. This and this there. There we go, ladies and gents. Let's open up the loot. Let's get it. Hey, Sai, can we mod mods? What is that supposed to mean? I have no idea. Modding mods. I, I don't know what that is, but hey. I will go and say no. You can't do that. Just a question, did they remove police station or is it because I'm a newbie? I mean, the police station is literally there, so they didn't remove it. But if you started the game in order to unlock it, you need to go to this watchtower here. That's in the middle of the map here. This watchtower here. You need to go there and uh, just do things there. Unlock that watchtower and you'll be able to go to the police department. There we go. There is that. How long have you been playing this game? Well, I've been playing it for about five years. For a bit longer than five years. But it's time for us to open up two purple cards. Let's exchange that again. It's not worth it, but we are doing it. We are doing it. Let's open up one, two, and then let's open up the blue card. There we go. Let's start from the blue. Inside of the blue, we've got in the VSS double magazine blueprint. And that other garbage here we've got in the handmade silencer. All right, but I don't need that blueprint. And here we've gotten the VSS Psy times 5 blueprint. All right, but I don't need that blueprint. So we have gotten the loot, but not the loot that I need. All right, let's try to bring these guns back to the base. Let's go, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go. There we go, nothing here. Let's say we can skedaddle, we can bring the loot back to the base. How do I increase my chance to get a gas tank? Just clear bunker alpha, which is here, or you can also try to clear the farm location and if the barn opens up, because it doesn't open up all the time, but sometimes the barn opens up and there sometimes you can find a gas tank. That's it. And gas tank is pretty common. You can clear bunk crowd for like maybe two, three, four times and you should be able to get it. But if you don't get it like in about four or five times, then just keep clearing it and one day you'll get it. You don't get purple machete blueprint because you don't run in circles for good luck before opening the blue box. It says exception thinker. I should have definitely done that. Do you have a button on your desk for each of those sounds effects? LMAO says YouTube Premium. Welcome YouTube Premium. No, I don't have button on the desk. Everything is done on the keyboard and I just have shortcuts. For example, control zero is going to be the, the clapping sound effect. Control three is going to be that. If I'm not mistaken, wait, I just forgot. There we go. Control one is to zoom in here. Control two it does other thing and control five zooms in here. When I start thinking about it, it's kind of harder to know the buttons, but it's it's more of a muscle memory. Like if I want to just zoom in in the game, I go there. I don't think that it's control five. I just know where to hit. Does it make sense? It makes sense. Same thing when switching cameras here. If I want to go in full screen, I'll go control F1. If I want to go back to the game, control F2. If I want to go back to the top, control F7. If, uh, what other things I got? There's nothing else to do. Those are all the things. I don't think I got any uh, more buttons. But hey, if needed, we can add more buttons there. Like, the possibilities are endless. Stream deck. <laughs> Keyboard is my stream deck. Uh, all right, let's drop the guns here in the chest. A 
in these chests. <laughs> Control F to pay respects, says Biraj. Yes. Biraja, yes. Control F to pay respect. What would you do if... What would you do for stream if Last and Earth shut down tomorrow? What would I do for streams? I mean, I'd stream now more Ark Survival. And, uh, I don't know, then we'll see. I mean, there are plenty of survival games that I'd start streaming more often. Uh, let's get that. Um, and the raid, right? Because we were doing those 99 waves just for the raid, so let's do it. Let's do the raid. Okay, let's craft the armor. Let's recycle those guns. Armor. There we go. Let's get the armor. Stream Warzone. No, but thank you for the suggestion. Really cool. I guess this prove arena, uh, proves arena is better for purple blueprints. I mean, even with those grenades, I have used... Wait, how many? 10, 20, 25. I used more than 25 guns even there. Right? Even with grenades, I've still used a bunch of guns. Correct? Definitely correct. I mean, obviously for purple blueprints, I have gotten like four in return. Obviously, exchanging blue for purple, I think definitely the arena is way better. So yeah, that's why I'm saying arena event is amazing. And I think a lot of people underappreciated it. But hey, I'm here to let you know that the arena event is awesome. And if you want to get purple blueprints, it's the best way to get purple blueprints. And too much healing. Yes, you also need lots of healing items and lots of armor sets compared to the arena. Again, some of the loot, you recoup some of the loot from those purple cards, right? You get like two armors and uh, and eight guns from two purple, if you even get two purple per 99 waves, because I don't think you'll always get that many. But still, if you don't exchange them for purple, then you can actually get a lot of cool loot. But we are talking about purple mods. So there's this. All right, let's drop these things. And we got one more thing to do to recycle three guns. So let's recycle it, ladies and gents, and then let's start rolling. Which is sad music shortcut? Control 3. It's like, what does Control 2 do? Control 2 does this. Psych merch. Psych.com. That's what the Control 2 does. Let's do it. We've recycled some of these weapons. I mean, we might as well just recycle some more fragments, titanium fragment pieces. But yeah, those controls are kind of annoying in some games. Like, let's say if I... In some games, like, let's say Control F2 might do... F2 might do something. So if I'm going to be clicking Control F2, in some games, F2 will trigger, like, an emote. Maybe the guy will start waving or whatever, and that gets kind of in the way. You can't change shortcuts in the game settings, but... Whatever. Control 84? I don't have Control 84. But thank you for the suggestion. Now he captured... Now Saik is lying. He captured some people who clap. Mm. Yes. No. For legal reasons, no. I didn't capture anybody. Yes. All right, let's try to get these hatchets. Uh, five hatchets. Let's get five normal hatchets. This and this.
two, three, four. Shut down button. There is no shut down button. What there's the there's actually this button where the screen goes black. Controller four. So I mean we can call that a shutdown button, but it's not really a shutdown button. I've had buttons before to mute the camera, but I don't remember which one is it, and I never use it, so there's that. I don't have a dedicated button to go live anyways, because to go live I need to confirm it. You need to click yes if you click the that button, so I don't need a shortcut for that. But I have a button to start recording, it's control and minus. It might sound confusing, but again, it's not like you click keep clicking those buttons constantly. You get the habit of it. Alright, guys. We got the weapons, and it's time for us to go for the raid number three. What does Alt of 4 does? Uh, what Alt of 4 does? Alt of 4, boom, this. Oh my goodness! Psyik, you fell for the trick! Guys, I'm still here. I ain't that stupid. Let's go on YouTube and let's do a little bit of research on this raid name numbers. 88727. LDE raid 88727. Have I raided it before? Might be the first time I'm raiding this base. From the research that I'm doing, it looks like I've never raided this base before. And I think I know why. Ladies and gentlemen, behold the best base you've ever seen. Ideas are making a drum roll button? I don't know. I don't know. Where do I enter it from? I don't even know. Whatever. Let's open this up. Glockman. There's got to be a base named Glockman. Indeed, there, there is a base named Glockman. Probably. All right. Let's add some. Uh, let's punch these chests. Let's chop them down. A little bit of wood. Nothing. Well, this raid is gonna be awesome. I mean, we've we've kind of done 20 waves for this raid. But yeah, so all of that grind for three copper ores. Am I surprised? No. Would I like something better? Obviously. I'll be grateful for something better. You might be like, hey, it's like, that's it. No, there's gotta be one more part in this base. This base is still not done yet. There's something else in this base. There's more stuff here, no? There we go. Look at this, guys. There's one more tiny shack here. There is something else at the base. There we go. Some more chests. Alright, so let's open it up. A little bit of wood. Maybe I'm gonna bring those planks to the base. That'll be something. Get Sykes approval perfectly. Yes, indeed. This base is perfect for the Sykes approval. Garbage enough. I mean, honestly, guys, I don't think it'll get Sykes approval, though. Like, Sykes approval is really low. Like, you need to be ten, uh, 2 out of 10 to get it, but this raid is probably not even gonna hit that. So there's this nothing useful here. And that is it. That is the raid, ladies and gentlemen. I mean, I, I might as well just get the duct tape. I'm going to the base anyways. So that is it. This base does not get Sykes approval. Definitely could have been better base. Definitely. But hey, nobody's surprised. 
10 out of 10, 11 out of 10. Guys, stop it. We all know that this base is... Uh, is unraidable. You cannot raid it. We don't have a scale to... to raid these awesome raids. Amazing. Alright, let's drop that there. The thing. And let's drop duct tapes. To get Sark's disapproval, says the Minecrafter, maybe. My disapproval. I've never given a disapproval to anybody. But this base, I will probably get it. Maybe I need to start handing out Sark's dis disapprovals. Cyrix's disapprovals, huh? Hmm. Sounds decent. Alright, let's try to pay these raiders. I'm gonna give them... A few of those heat sensors. Maybe only one will suffice. And let's call these schmucks on the radio again. It's like, what would you be doing now as ethereal? Well... Let me tell you what we'll be doing now. We will be wrapping up this live stream. That's what we're gonna do. Uh, that's what we'll be doing right now, guys. So, hey, thanks everybody for joining. See you tomorrow with another video. I don't know what that'll be. Either Grounded or The Infected. One of those two. Probably the infected because the grounded episode two is not finished yet, so probably it'll be tomorrow, uh, after tomorrow, after after tomorrow. I mean, but yeah, that's it, guys. So thanks for being everybody. Thanks for being here. Take care. See you next time with another video and more live streams as well. Take care, guys. Thanks for everything. Shout out to all of you. Take care, everybody, and see you later, guys. Take care. Take care. Take care. Take care, guys. Take care. Take care.